Hey YouTube, Mr. KD here and standing right in front of you is Keto Diamond and we are leaving Planet Fitness and this is Keto and Fitness Day 58, 58 days people. No, they we got, didn't go every single day, but it's still 58 days. We've been doing this journey for 58 days. They got planner stickers. And she's happy about that. <laughs> she's grabbed them up two days in a row now. Well, two visits in a row. So we're going to go home. We're going to tell you the good things, the bad things, the okay things, and the all right things. But first, like, subscribe, share. What are you telling them to do? Ring the bell. Ring the bell. I was telling you to get close to setting up in the trunk. And now, it's time, folks. Hubby's having two beef patties, two pieces of cheese, Organic ketchup, mustard, and mayonnaise with some collard greens. Cut into the strawberries again. Ten of them. <laughs> so, we made it home. So, as you saw, we made it to the gym today. Yeah, my back's still bothering me. Yeah, it, I mean, it's it been a really bad week. Uh, but we did go. I did work out a little bit, but I kept it light and mostly away from my back except for I did do my abs which also works my back a little bit might have been a mistake we'll see but I did use uh, the hydro massage chair I think it made my back hurt a little worse but I ain't sure but that could be my fault because I was controlling the speed the pressure and where it went so I might need to toy with it a little bit till I get the right but it felt great it's just when I got off it I felt a little bit more tender but it could be because I the pain went away while I was on it. And then, then you then, felt it again? Then, I, then it came back. <laughs> uh, I did, like I said, like, I lowered my weights a little bit because I didn't want to push it too hard. But I did work on my chest a little bit and my biceps and my abs because Monday is measurement time again, which I'll probably do it tomorrow since I'll have more time and I don't have to work. So I'll be able to squeeze it all in tomorrow. Anything you want to say? Yeah, uh, I think eating like such a big heavy meal, you'll see it tomorrow what we ate, but um, I kept having to go back on my speed. Like I, I usually go three miles per hour for 35 to 40 minutes. You just not used to it. You started hurting right in here, didn't you? Yeah, I had that mm -hmm. pain in my side like you used to get after just, lunch. What, you had to go for a walk with a mile. At when I was doing the cardio with it, I would get that because I was always eat before I went to the gym. And I always get that. I just got to push through it. Yeah, well, I couldn't. I just, I, what I did was instead of like doing three miles per hour the whole time, I'd back down to 2.5 or 2.8 and then back to but three. But she still did uh, 1.75, so that she, yeah, it was, I still it was, walked it was a great workout. Work uh -huh. It's all about building up her heart muscle anyway. So While watching Slapped Ham. Uh, Y'all saw what I ate yesterday. It wasn't enough. Never Not is. even close. Mm -hmm. I'm a, I was a thousand calories short, but I, I was. you already have that many calories today so far. But. It was better than what I was getting because it was 1,500 calories. So, yeah, it is what it is. I mean, I eat. I mean, y'all see me eat. It's just never enough. We'll figure something out. I don't know. I mean, I have a lot, I have a lot, a lot, a lot of trouble going on in my life right now. And it keeps me from eating a lot. A lot of times I just don't have an appetite. There ain't nothing I can do about it. I mean, the medication could be causing a little bit of it. Uh, I don't know. Just, he was also concerned about his blood pressure today. Oh, yes. I'm going to show you all that. Let me put that in right here. That was uh, the first time I took it, and this is the second time I took it. And then I did check it a third time. That was when we went to Walmart because I want to make sure the cuff was reading right, and it was still high, but it came down some. As you all saw that last time, that it was uh, 164 over 104, I think is what it was. And at Walmart, it was 138 over 94. So it came back down. I'm getting ready to go check it again and see if it came back down. I don't know why it went up. I've never in my life had high blood pressure. It's never been not normal. Now, it has been low a few times, but never high. And so we don't really know what's caused that. We think it's probably the pain, but I've been dealing with this pain. It'll be five years in uh, July. And it's, it's peaking lately, though. When I'm thinking maybe it's Even at my worst... And when I was going to the doctor, they never said anything about my blood pressure being high, ever. Right. 
But even if it was high, they would consider it pain related. Well, but it was never high. It's never been over 120, ever. Uh, so I'm a little bit worried about that. It could be the medication I'm taking, but I don't think it is. They have them on two now for the first time in this and whole life. So. It could be that it don't mix with the Trimadol. I'm going to have to talk to my doctor about it if the blood pressure don't stabilize on its own. I'm not about to go through life with high blood pressure all of a sudden because there's definitely something causing that. Yeah, for it to spike and stay high, but I, I think it'll come back down. I do. I think we just need to keep an eye on it. Look, I don't know. It's been a pretty good day, and I was happy with the workout I did. I didn't push it too hard, but I like she said, I probably shouldn't have messed with my abs, but my main areas I want to see results in is my abs, my chest, and my biceps because those are the areas people see the most. I'm just saying while your back's in, in peak hurt, I would leave my back and my abs alone just for a little bit, let, let everything heal. Yeah, I probably won't do that. None of us said I was smart. Uh, he's got a point. Uh, what else was that? That was something else I was wanting to tell y'all. Uh, oh, yeah, my weight for the day. Mm. Uh, even eating, it's still dropping. New low, 146 even. And that was 146.6. Six, I think, mm -hmm. or point four. Really, point four, point six. What I said yesterday. Uh, here's what it is. I'm not upset about it. She is. She's worried, and I guess she should be. I ain't getting enough calories. That's I mean. We're trying to hook him up today, but we'll see if it works. Yeah, I probably already got eleven hundred off that burger. That one burger, yeah. yeah. And then I had ten, cheese or twelve two. strawberries and a piece of cheese and. One protein shake, and I'm getting ready to drink two more. That way, I, I need to have the protein I need for the muscles. Uh, oh, Robin. Oh, that's for my channel. It said both of us. Mm. Robin, thank you so much for what you sent us. She's going to go into detail on with, with, with all, what all it was and show it on her channel, but thank you so much. It means a lot to us. We really enjoy the snack packs, girl. That's great. It's awesome. Really, mm. thank you. Uh, so, let's wrap this video up. If you ain't checked out her channel, Y'all know the routine. It's in the description. Down. Go check it out. She's hilarious. She's informative. And she knows her stuff. And uh, I help everybody. Also, she has a website, ketodiamond.com, with a uh, complete food list, beginner guides, question and answers, and all kinds of stuff. Go check it out. There's a lot of info on there and a lot of stuff that can help y'all out if y'all need it. Also, if you need to contact either one of us, mostly her, because if you contact me, and I don't know what I'm going to ask her, but you can contact me. I might know it. Our email is in the description. If you're looking for some yummy, yummy sweets, well, it's not really sweets, but it's will satisfy you just as good as any sweet, Performance Nut Butter is in the description. And also, if you are wanting to up your protein, Orgain Keto Protein Powder, completely keto-friendly, 100%, and tastes like a Frosty from Wendy's. 30% off your first purchase, so check it out if you're interested. And also, if you want me to be your friend on Facebook, add me, my magician. Information is in the description. I won't be offended, but just a little bit if you don't. A whole lot. <laughs> she will never hear the end of it, so don't, don't put her through that. She's got enough stress. You ain't lying. <laughs> Y'all have a God-blessed day.